Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Astrix Solution. This video we are going to solve the practical number 4.4, .4, which is writing a JSP to determine whether an incoming number is a prime number or not. So it's quite a simple practical, but uh, as you, this is the first practical we are doing on JSP. As you know, we have written all our servlets in Java resource file in SRC. And uh, you can see the lists here we have done for servlets. Now, when you want to write a JSP, you need to write that in the web content. So you need to remember that all the JSPs goes in the web content. So what I'm going to do now, I right click on my web content folder and I make a JSP. Okay. And let's say determine prime dot JSP. I'm naming it as determine prime dot JSP. So it will open up my file now. Now JSP have its own nine implicit objects of which request is one of the object. So I'll do what? Start a scriptlet here and accept the number. So let's say int number is equal to integer dot parse int request dot get parameter request dot okay get parameter double quotes of id request dot get parameter double quotes id and now you have to determine whether this number is prime or not so to determine whether the number is prime or not we need to run a loop it starts from 2 and it goes till the number minus 1 so let's say for and i have to take a flag so int flag is equal to 0 uh, the logic for uh, prime number finding is discussed more in depth in another video of mine and it, it has very good graphics you can just watch the video in the, uh, for the description box and you'll understand how to determine whether a number is prime or not so now let's say int i is equal to 2 i is less than equal to number minus 1 i plus plus so i'm starting the loop from 2 and going till number minus 1 and now what i do if number mod i equals equals 0 so if the number get divided anywhere in between that, that means my uh, that number is not prime for example for 7 7 is not divisible by 2 by 3 by 4 by 5 or by 6 it's only divisible by 1 and 7 so those numbers are prime number so let's say if i pass 6 so 6 is first thing first divisible by 2 so it won't go ahead from there and i'm put up putting up a flag here and i'm just putting up a break so that if i come out of this loop and my flag value is not equal to 0 so if flag equals equals still equals 0 it means the number is prime so i'll just say out dot println prime number else out dot println i'll say not a prime number so a simple jsp file to determine whether the number is prime or not right click on it after you write the code just right click on it and say run as run on server finish if you're watching this directly from this video you can go and go back and see the servlet videos to how to set up the eclipse in uh, our tomcat in eclipse so it's starting the service first time i'll get number format exception because I haven't passed any values here yet. Okay, so it started to run. I, as expected, it is getting number format exception. Now, question mark ID. Okay, I made a mistake. I shouldn't have taken it as ID, but still I have taken. So I'll run it now. Now let's say if I pass ID is equal to seven, it says it's a prime number. But if I pass six, it say not a prime number. So this is how you write a simple program to determine whether a JSP is a, a normal JSP program to determine whether an incoming number is a prime number or not the logic is very simple you can find the code in the description box and thank you for watching this video do share with your friends thank you